It is a song which was composed in the Yenabo age during the reigns of King Mindo, who founded the Yenabo city, which is known as Mandalay City. Everybody knows Mandalay. And the song was composed in honor of the king. The original melody was the last session from the Kongbong, uh, last session of the song, Kongbong Barami. It is a long, um, traditional Asian song. <coughs> composed by Nyari Menyi Usa in 1838 during the reigns of King Tayari. The lyrics was by an anonymous person. The composer of Gombang video usually took the earlier melody and gave body to the separate by embracing new words and expression just like just like the Western composer took melody from the earlier composer and wrote variation fantasy, etc. During the Gombang video, Senti 52 to 1885. Myanmar had economic and diplomatic relations with Sam, Western countries, and as a result, Myanmar musicians had Sam exposure to classical music and appreciated it. So they include, included Western musical areas in their own composition. Nyari Meni Usa composed the song Gombang Barami by adapting <coughs> the patterns of dividing the music into sessions, licensing classical music. The song we are going to present now is composition of the original melody of last session from the accompaniments of that song. This song is the proof that Myanmar traditional music had early exposure to classical music. The way the melody goes in, is in Myanmar traditional style, with the burden of the biting session. This type of songs were popular among people because it's foreign melodies and liveness. Moreover, the dumbassing of the natural key of Myanmar traditional music, such as use of accidental in fourth degree is formed. In this song, all types of Myanmar traditional music use two fours and four four times. The Myanmar traditional music players used to call two four time wala and four four time nayi. And in this song, four four time nayi is used. And this this song we are going to present now is dedicated to King Mindo, the title of the song Myanmangiri Min. Emirat Green Mandalay Hill. The lyrics in the first bird means that the Mandalay city was founded at the foot of the Mandalay Hill. Its founder was a superhuman with great power and also the royal blood descended from the Kongbong dynasty. He was loved by the people and also received respect from all the other city state governors. The positions of Raya White Elephant is emphasized in second verse because it was long regarded prestigious by Myanmar. In addition, uh, king, the king will rule the city accompanied by so many queens who are divinely beautiful. The performance of ancient Myanmar traditional music can be divided into two. One was court chamber music which which entertained the king presently at the palace by instruments such as harps and xylophone, and like a Thai traditional xylophone, Yamada xylophone. And the other is the court ceremonial music or outdoor music. This type of entertainment was conducted to outside the palace to enhance the listener high spirits and energies of the listener by using Myanmar traditional orchestra, including Myanmar traditional circus of drum. It's also like a Thailand drum drum. Although the original song, Kongbong Burami, is in the repertoire of chamber music, the present session is 
played in open air. The song, Nyamangiri, has long been appreciated by Myanmar people up to now. In our Myanmar society, the power of music has been utilized for the purpose of ensuring success in the field, politics, economy, social, and religious affairs, as well as, as well as in military and health affairs. In other words, history saw that music had sucked well in arousing the fighting spirit and nationalism, and many well-being can be promoted through the healing power of music. Uh, this music can be compared to other music, the outdoor music by George Frederick Chandler, who, Handel, who composed for the pleasures of the king while sailing on the Thames River. And uh, now you listen to the music. Another video, I want to show another video clip. Yes. This is more harmonized style. Oh. Yes. Like a, a song called, uh, oh, song called. Yes. yes. So, so they, they can listen to the, the, the real sound. I mean, this is very needy. <laughs> yeah. uh, you have other uh, example from your collection? Uh, uh, but uh, I have. Uh, no. Not. <laughs> okay. I have not. Well, I, I would suggest uh, our friend to go yeah. for YouTube no. and uh, just type this uh, Manantiri song. When, when you play with um, uh, 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 the harp or the traditional 
channels, sounds, yes, yes, it's very yes, touching. Yes. Um, it's not like it's you know, like, it's like this. Yes. Uh, uh. I feel the surprise <laughs> of this. So I, I when I listen, uh. let listen this traditional Thai traditional music. When I listen the yes. this music, I feel the real surprise of this song. Mm -hmm. It's one of the most beloved songs of her. Yes. Mm -hmm. This song is mm -hmm. very yes, popular among <laughs> our, our people. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> I, I will give the floor for our friend to share your idea, comments, or uh, questions. Please. Mm -hmm. Any suggestion? Any question? Yes, I would have actually the same question as you, but how is the original form actually? The original sound, uh, the original tuning, mm. and uh, so it, it's quite difficult for me to, to evaluate uh, this, this result because it's, yeah, me. Perhaps you can try Can we get, get uh, no, not our YouTube now? Perhaps um, the try the, the, the Original sound first. Mm -hmm. Even you know, played tune. by a guitar or uh, the uh, piano, the, the real one, totally different from this MIDI. Myanmar tuning system, tuning system oh, is yeah. and now we Western. we use now traditional musician use international tuning system, but early time they use the uh, bug, uh, bug, uh, little bug, uh, shouting the little bug, uh, sound of little bug and bullock and elephant such as uh, animal so, uh, sound of animal they, uh, they are standard tuning they're uh, used to standard tuning animals uh, voice of animals <coughs> what you call it and, and each descent uh, like from the descent, descent yeah. yes the reason I'm asking this because there is a cliche that Southeast Asian tuning, some except fellow and slender mm -hmm. is equidistant tuning. Mm -hmm. And I ask this question because in Cambodia we don't have the official Cambodian tuning because we still disagree with uh, among the music teachers yeah, and yeah. even at the Ministry of Culture. Yes. Uh, all that we disagree because it depends on the training. Yes. Uh, I have Western training. My ears are tuned to temple tuning. And I realize that we cannot do tempo tuning in Cambodian music, but it's not equivalent either. And uh, therefore, up until now, we don't have the official Cambodian tuning. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. And I'm wondering whether or not Myanmar has oh, yes, yes. a standard tuning. Yes, right, right. Yes. Not 
it's too slow. Uh, and al already with the ASEAN Orchestra, many of us are part of the ASEAN Orchestra. Mm -hmm. We developed an idea, we coined an idea. If you wish, but the, 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 the Wi Fi is too slow. How can my system uh, play with Slender Opera or with the Thai system or with the Myanmar system? Therefore, the principle and philosophy of that is that. Music making is humanistic, it's not really scientific. Even we say that you know, to understand is to understand. But when you play a movie, the play system includes Oman, there are nine Oman movies at home. American system is to understand the music, but to at home. So the diatonic semitone and chromatic semitone, chromatic semitone is core Oman in French system. And the uh, No. the same, uh, the, uh, the dominant is the same, and the systolic is the same. In between, you adapt, uh, things like that. I agree with you because, um, uh, again, some people would say that we don't need this. This is the same with the freedom and the richness of the core varieties of things that exist in our tradition. Uh. But, again, there is another group of people who said we have to create a, a system so that we can... Uh, and if I bring the xylophone from the north, I cannot play together because the tuning is different. Yeah. Uh, yes. No, because the tuning is different. You know, in the city, we are so modernized, the tuning of the xylophone in the city is closer to piano because they do recording in the studio, all of these things. See? Okay, I, I, I accept that. Uh, but the, um, I'm special to Paris in Gamelan. So what I was always fascinating for me, we play in village A, we play a certain piece, and it has a special tuning. If you go to village B, 500 meters uh, beside, they have a slightly different tuning, and the character of the same tuning is yeah. different. And I think this variety is fascinating, ah. because music can then have the same piece, can express different expressions. Okay. And that's why I really like if the tuning is built in a kind of classical, <laughs> modern music. It's different than tonal music. Hello. Tonal music, I think, is a situation. Hello. Okay. Well, I agree with you, but <laughs> okay. people have so, so many different <laughs> ideas. And sorry, but sorry. <laughs> sorry so we can return to this uh, very good example of a. Uh, the music that we're going to preview tonight with um, uh, the song of the harp sound. <laughs>
So that's very different from the BD yeah. sound. Yeah. 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 Uh, every time when they do a cycle, <laughs> repeat the act, uh, automation, whatever it is. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>